Maybe I will, maybe I won't. Mm, okay. Yeah. <laughs> right, come here. See you later. Bye. Hey, looking forward to tonight. Yeah, so I can see. No, I meant the four of us going out together. Oh, I can hardly wait. Mm. Oh, hey. Hey, didn't know you'd be back for dinner. Uh, yeah, well, there was something that I wanted to unpass you, actually. Oh, you could have sent me a text. Oh, thanks. Anyone would think that you didn't want to see me. Hey, don't put that on. Oh. Come on, then. What did you want to tell me? Well, um, Carly's asked if me and you want to meet her and Ross in the pub tonight. Um, does Ross know? Yeah. Well, you obviously said we're busy, right? Oh, well, I kind of got sucked in. I, I felt bad for it. Listen, it'll only be for an hour. OK, why not? Hmm. Oh. Well, that was easier than I thought. Well, I suppose you'll have to make it up to me, won't you? For you. Mm. Well, you don't have to fork out for these anymore. Got a load of freebies off Carly. She's keen. Yeah, it's going all right. Great, actually. How's you and Pete? Yeah, we're good. And tonight we're double dating. Yeah, well, who knows? Might be a laugh. Pete, socialising. <laughs> yeah, bound to be. Did you have to twist his arm? No, I didn't, actually. He was really up for it. Mm. Customer. I'm at work. Yeah, and I said I would get it to you. Now, I'm gonna have to go. I can't talk right now. I'll call you back as soon as I can. So a customer can't phone you at work? Was that Charlie? Don't worry about it. Do you still owe him money? Ross! Hey! Take a hint, and for once in your life, will you mind your own business? And I'm sorry, where was my invite? Believe me, you're more than welcome to join us. Oh, it's dead grown up, this, isn't it? The four of us together. Mind you, you're used to this kind of thing, aren't you? Nice, quiet meal in the pub and you're happy. Well, we're only in here because you suggested it. Our clubbing's more our thing, isn't it, babe? <laughs> yeah, life and soul of the party is our Pete. Makes friends wherever he goes. Well, there's no way I could just be friends with you. Mm -hmm. I can keep my hands off you. <laughs> so, um, how was the first day at the shop? Yeah, yeah, I mean, I'm running off my feet, but I reckon I'm going to make a killing. Well, I won't be shopping anywhere else. <laughs> Until he finds a better offer. You all right, love? <laughs> what are you up to? Double date, Grandad. All right, I'll have to bring Lisa next time, make it a triple, eh? <laughs> right, should I get another round in? Whoa, whoa. Uh, <clears throat> now then. Uh, yeah. On me. Thank you. You feeling all right? Well, I could treat me granddaughter, can't I? <laughs> Mine's a pint. <laughs> well, you lot look all cosy. <laughs> yeah, after all another ten minutes and I think I might scream. Mm, so at least if I don't get back for my tea. <laughs> Steady with that. <sighs> uh, Zach, hmm? well, I've, I've got to go, lad. Yeah, about that fight. Oh, why? <laughs> How could I forget? You did great. I'd like to chuck you on myself in, in my prime, like. But... Yeah, well, the bloke who arranged it, he wants the money back. What for? You want that fair and square. Yeah, but, well, that's the thing. I was supposed to throw it. What? Throw the fight? Oh, lad, that's a mug's game. Yeah, but then Debbie said about all the money that you had on me winning, and I couldn't see it through. You were supposed to lose? Yeah, and it's got me in a bit of trouble. <sighs> a lot of trouble. What? I know you want some of my winnings? Yeah. Oh, no chance. Hey, that money is down to me. I, I'm grateful, obviously, but... You know what? It's the first time I've had any money for years. I can provide for my family, put a bit on one side for a rainy day. And it feels good. And you want me to hand it all over to you? Look, next time, back yourself to win. Feel a thing? Yeah? Right, uh, I'm looking to the loo and then we're going home. Oh, babe, so soon. You know, I used to think you were a right hard face cow. <laughs> really? Is that right? Yep, yeah, but I was wrong. I reckon we're going to be great mates. <laughs> Look at me. Sinking pretty low, isn't it? You what? Chasing my granddad for money. It's not his fault that you're in this mess, so you do nothing without talking to me first, right? Fine. Then you'll give me the money then, won't you? Yeah, 
exactly what I thought. But I've got to get that money from somewhere. 